sir. What have I? Huh? Is the medicine still affecting you? Medicine. Should we get him to a hospital? We should probably wait and see a little longer. I... I... <laughs> I must atone. <laughs> no! Was his heart changed? Did the temporary death serum not work? Sir, if he's had a change of heart, will he blab everything about us? Yeah. <laughs> everything will be ruined. What are we supposed to do about his campaign? Announce that he's not feeling well. Arrange a hospitalization in absolute secrecy. Don't let anyone near him. Uh, yes, sir. Uh, yes, sir. Keep the media out. Damn it, we have to do something. Well, the only thing you could do is, like, kill him and then, like, try and frame it on us. But that's not going to work so well, is it? <laughs> so we did it? Whoa! What the? Judging from his lacerations, it would appear he was kidnapped, then killed at another location, and. Sojiro! Don't tell me. I'm going to get angry if you don't come out. Sojiro. <laughs> hey, didn't know you guys were... <sighs> don't scare me like that. You're the same as Ryuji. <laughs> what are you talking about? I was taken to that asshole Shido's place. They suddenly told me I could go home. That's thanks to his change of heart, right? Something like that. Thought as much. They had me blindfolded the whole time, so I've got no idea where they took me. Though it, it sounded like they were oddly bustling about. Looks like it's going well. Man, my handsome mug was nearly ruined. That's uh, all fine and dandy. But they really did a number on this place. Yeah, I'll help you clean it. I'm sorry. Sorry to bother you two when you're tired. But I need you to help me clean up. Yes. We just have to wait like usual now. I will definitely help you clean up this mess. It's partially my fault. We finally did it. We've done all we can. We started off with a huge announcement this time after all. I can't wait for the results. But all that popularity doesn't matter anymore. Right, things like approval ratings aren't important now. Yeah, we definitely did the right thing for society. You just gotta be proud about it, am I right? Of course. All that's left is to wait calmly for the results. Alright. We should act as normal as we can while we're waiting, too. Big Scoop. This one's a pretty dark rumor about the big shot producer in the entertainment industry. Apparently, he's been forcing young idols and other girls to have sex with him to move up in the ranks. It feels like he's just feeding off their dreams. <sighs> I can't overlook that. Right? Anyway, have you heard of Shiro Asakura? It seems like he's behind these crimes. Well, I'll be counting on you for the rest. Hmm. This guy might not be famous, but we can't let him go. Let's talk to everyone at the hideout when we have the time, okay? Definitely gonna take that guy down. 
And you guys nailed it. That was so exciting. Never would have imagined you were up against Shido. I'm glad I kept the fan site running through all the criticism too. I think I'll change up the survey questions to commemorate your comeback. I'll obviously be answering yes this time. I believe in you. Stay strong. This guy never changes. Well, it sounds like he's looking forward to how it goes. All we can do is wait now too. Do, 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 do. I'm guessing we're, uh, we're going to hit the end of the game. I've reconsidered my opinion of you, inmate. The look on your face seems to be that of a man who has accomplished a great deed. Mm -hmm. To think you would use the trap set against you to entrap them. I've never seen a dramatic resurgence such as that. Truly marvelous. Those are the only words I can think of to describe you. Um... <laughs> I owe you a lot. We should be thanking you for entertaining us thus. You've even overcome a mysterious misfortune. There should be no one left to hinder your rehabilitation. Your rehabilitation will be completed shortly. That is, if everything goes well without any problems. <laughs> that's... that's ominous. Uh, what could possibly go wrong from here? Besides them trying to kill Shido off and accuse us of it. <sighs> Damn. How many times have I had this dream? Or could it be that it's not a dream at all? My memories aren't any closer to coming back to me. Might there be something I'm supposed to remember? <sighs> if... If I'm not really human... And if the truth of that comes to pass down in the depths of Mementos, I... Could it be that I'll... Akio... It's gonna be okay, Morgana. We did it! Everybody saved! Everything's good. Do you support the Phantom Thieves? Indeed. It has finally ended. I've been here, people watching as usual. Is there something you'd like to do to kill time, Akio? I miss you. <laughs> you must have a wealth of free time if that is your decision. I'm still mulling over what Kano Kawabane said to me. That reminds me, I'd like to speak with you and the others. Do you have some free time today? Yes, I do. Indeed. I would like other opinions as well. I shall send out an invite and see who has time to meet. I wish to do so at LeBlanc, if that is alright with you. Sorry. My apologies for calling all of you here like this. Boss was even kind enough to serve us coffee be coffee before he went shopping. Now then, I have a vital request. Hey! Hit me with your best shot. All the tough problems are gonna have to go to Akio though. Hey! Hmm, I can help with any subject that's not math. Hmm? Do you two honestly believe I would ask you here for help in my studies? To tell the truth. The truth is, I am planning to display my work in a competition. The one organized by Kawanabe of the Japanese Art Support Foundation. You remember, yes, Akio? I must win and prove not only my ability, but my intense passion for art as well. However, I am having quite a bit of trouble determining what my next subject should be. I have given this painting a fair amount of thought, but nothing has come to me yet. Hence, 
I was hoping to hear your opinions on an ideal subject. Oh yeah! Ryuji. How about you have on strip? Wait! Ugh, how long are you gonna keep bringing that up? Anyway, maybe you should paint something people find pretty. Hmm. Hmm. So in the end, we return to the concept of beauty. Akio, what subject do you think would capture... Akio, what subject do you think would most capture beauty? Uh... <laughs> I, I wouldn't say any of these. Well, I meant, like, for his answer. I mean, I'll just go with this because this is what I would pick. Hmm, I suppose she is a subject I put great focus on in the past, but now I am aware of her true personality. I'm not sure I could paint her beautifully. <laughs> That's right. Wait, what's that supposed to mean? Why can I not paint a beauty as pure as the Sayuri? Where have all my studies gone? Hmm. You know, I'm not really sure what you mean by pure beauty. I mean, yeah, it's a pretty painting, but I'm not sure I really consider it a pure beauty or whatever. Huh? Hmm? I don't know, it feels... I don't know, I guess it just feels more gentle to me. Honestly, I almost cried the first time I saw the Sayuri. It kind of felt like I was a baby again in my mother's arms. She was watching over me, telling me everything was going to be okay. How is the gentleness that the painting made me feel? <laughs> this is coming from someone with absolutely no art knowledge, though. I see. Gentleness. It is yet another aspect this Sayori captured that I cannot. Is my heart too cloudy? No way, man. It ain't cloudy, dude. Are you sure about that? Painting used to be all my heart desired. I needed nothing else in life. <clears throat> but now. What now? I've become overwhelmed with the need to prove myself to Kuwanabe, to prove myself to the world. I look down on Madarame for focusing so sharply on fame and money, yet I too yearn for the praise of others. In truth, oftentimes I regret declining Kawanabe's offer. How could this be? Is this what pure passion is supposed to look like? My heart is clouded by worldly, worldly desires. You've really grown, Yusuke. What? My ugliness has helped me grow? Yep. Hakio's right, dude. Ain't nothing wrong about doing your best to make a living. Yeah. And you just want someone to acknowledge your work, right? That's some serious passion. But how can passion be born from these repulsive thoughts? Yeah. Listen here, dude. I was totally like you back on the track team. <laughs> I just wanted to prove myself, to win, to get all the girls to call me shit like Sakamoto Senpai. But you know, even through all of that, I was trying to help my team out. Sure, it's a solo sport, but nobody's gonna run till they puke if they don't got teammates they wanna inspire. I guess what I wanna say is, you gotta do stuff for people beyond just yourself if you wanna succeed. I see. Is that how it is? So the sincere gentleness held within the Sayuri, the warmth of its heart, it was all for the sake of those who gaze upon it? How interesting. So that's what you mean. Huh, I see. Huh? What'd you see? I have been a fool. Beauty is not a superficial thing I have long thought it to be. It is something that wells up within the heart until it breaks free. It is a gift given by a subject unto its viewer. Yes, I finally see the truth. That's the three of you have my sincerest gratitude. You have been a truly tremendous aid. Uh, uh yeah. how exactly? We somehow managed to help Yusuke out. I feel like my bond with Yusuke is growing deeper. All right. 
not that I need that anymore. Yes, the time has come for my brush to meet canvas in beautiful harmony. If you'll excuse me. Man, he's acting even weirder than normal. I like the consistency and the fact that like everybody has coffee besides Ryuji because he doesn't like it. It's the tiny details that really makes like this sort of thing stick out. Like Anne has her phone sitting out and that's, you know, I always have my phone out too. It's just, it feels super natural to have it look like this. I appreciate it. He looked pretty inspired though, so I guess I'll be fine, right? Anyway, are you guys hungry? I might ask Boss to make me something once he gets back. Hmm, maybe curry this time. Come on. God, you eat so freaking much. Oh yeah, and what about that crap about being good at everything except math? It ain't nice to lie, you know. No! I wasn't lying, it's just really hard to get good grades at Shujin. No way, man. If you're not getting good grades, you should have known Yusuke wasn't going to ask you to study with him. And Ryuji and I enjoyed the rest of our time together. Hey, it's getting late. I should probably take them to the train station. Ah, you're back. It's insane how popular Shido is. Unless he confesses, there's no way this is gonna change. They just believe everything Shido spoon feeds him. In that case, it wasn't a mistake for us to change his heart. I mean, we made the best possible choice, didn't we? Assuming the change of heart is successful. Indeed, there was truly no better way to go about it. Still, the current state of things is somewhat concerning. Let's have faith. It sucks real bad that we can't do anything more than that. I guess there's nothing we really can do until election day. Oh, oh, okay. I should be able to help him with it with my current level of kindness. You look like you have something to say. I feel like my bodily surgery will grow stronger soon. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I don't have... I don't have, um... This persona. Whoops. Well, I guess there's no point in worrying. Help me clean up. Kutaba? Hmm? What's wrong? Not like you to come here this late. Mm hmm. Look, Sojirel. Uncle's bank info, transaction history, credit details. I've got tons of dirt on him. How'd you get your hands on this stuff? Hacking, of course. Uncle's in loads of debt. He'll never win a suit against us now that we have all this data. <sighs> this is a criminal offense, you idiot. There's no way we'd be able to see use this stuff in court. But... Jeez. I've known all along how badly in debt he is. He's not gonna try and take custody back, so don't go doing stupid crap like this, okay? But Sojiro, I only did a it because of all the stuff he said to you. About that. I've been thinking, when push came to shove, I wasn't there to help. So, you know, maybe there's somewhere better for you out there. S somewhere better? Am I not supposed to be here? Am I just in the way? <sighs> no, that's not it. You don't want me either, Sojiro? That's not what I meant. I was just... I just think it might be better for your own sake. Fine! I still have Akio and Mona and all the others! You can just stay here and play with your stupid coffee beans! <sighs> she likes you guys way more than she likes me. Makes sense, though. You're the ones who saved her, after all. Where did I go wrong? I really did try to care for Futaba. Look where it got... Look where that got me, though. I told myself she was the reason I kept making Wakaba's curry here, but deep down, I think that was just an excuse to stay distant. At 
the end of the day, the coffee and curry people love so much are both just excuses. That's not true. But I mean, I spent more time in this cafe than I ever did trying to talk to Futaba. I'm gonna go out for a smoke, try to cool off a bit. Sorry to lay this on you. Can you go after Futaba for me? I should head upstairs. Akio! Do you want to talk? Yeah, thanks. You know, Mom used to talk about Sojiro tons when I was little. How good he was at making curry, how interesting he was to talk to. I remember everything. I even remember how she smiled when she talked about him. Mom really liked Sojiro. I said some real mean stuff tonight. It's not his fault mo mom's incident. It's not his fault mom's incident happened. It's not his fault I shut myself away from the world. And because of me, Sojiro lost a crap ton of money. I just thought I'd be able to stay here with him if my hacking worked. You should tell him that. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Futaba? Um, can I come in? Mm-hmm. Sojiro, I... Look, I'm sorry about what I just said. Look, I'm sorry about what I said just now. And well, if it's okay with you, I want you to stay here forever. Forever? I know it might be more fun living with people your age like Akio, but I'll do my damnedest to see things from your perspective. So, will you stay with me? Huh. <laughs> Was that supposed to be some kind of proposal? <laughs> hey, quit your laughing. <sighs> You're as exhausting as ever. Hey, Sojiro. I know it caused you a lot of trouble, but I really do want to stay here. So let's keep living together. Futaba. Sorry for not saying that earlier. Oh, and thanks for taking in someone as horrible as me. Are you sure I'm good enough? I wouldn't want anyone else. <laughs> no hesitation. Don't come complaining to me if you regret it. Actually, I'm not going to let you regret it. If you ever need help, just tell me. I might not be graceful, but I'll be there to protect you. And you can stay with me for as long as you like. Forever if you want. Mm-hmm, I will. Forever. I can't wait to keep sort of living with you too, Akio. It's almost time for the live stream. The director's gonna be on this week. I'm out of here, bye! such a fool. My whole life, I've taken the easy way out to avoid these kind of conflicts. I didn't stand up for Wakaba when I knew something was off. And I didn't stand up for you either. Instead, I went on and on about how you can't fight back against the laws of our society. How you should just accept the hand you're dealt in life. That those were mere excuses I made to keep myself in line. They gave me the easy way out I wanted so badly. Maybe instead of all that coffee crap, I should have been teaching you not to make the same mistakes I did. There I go, ranting again. But I feel like I managed to put a lot behind me today. Thanks. Thanks. For making me realize what's really important in life. What rank am I? Is that nine? That's only seven? All right. I'm going home. Alright, I better head home too. Don't stay up too late, okay? I don't want you oversleeping. <laughs> what is my kindness stat gonna do for me now? Give me guts. <laughs> Sorry, thank you. <coughs> hmm. 
The new Shido administration will pull us out of this recession and renew our economy. He's really the only option we have. I really hope he can succeed and not succumb to that slander. This election may very well be the historical turning point for this nation. We should feel lucky to be able to witness such a historic event. I should have known. The support for Shido is as strong as ever. I'm astounded he was able to deceive this many people. Madarame was a shrewd con artist, but Shido's on an entirely different level. But this charade will all come to a halt soon. Once he unveils the truth, the good people of Tokyo will rally together against this tyrant. Until then, I must be patient. Hey guys, this is Mina, and I have a I little bit no of a cold, so my throat sounds a little bad, but it will be okay. Um, I just wanted to let you guys know that Persona 5 will be part of my stream schedule, uh, mostly to get this game done at this point. It's really hard to find time to record uh, Persona 5 along with Danganronpa V3, along with doing streams. So the only thing I could figure to help finish this game is by throwing it into the streaming schedule. So I just wanted to let you know that the next episodes may be a little different. Um, thank, thank you so much for all your support. There's no way we'd be able to see use this stuff in court.